Hello! Oh, I'm asked. Welcome to the Futon <laughs> Crusaders. I am RG. And I'm Rai. Ah, today we'll be continuing our playthrough of... God damn, it still doesn't look right. <laughs> I guess they never look right. Of Chrono Trigger. The new, the additional endings edition. Yes, yes. Um, and as so, far as the mask goes, it's not like we paid a lot for them to look right. right. So sit back, relax, and let us lull you through time. And space. And you need to click over. Yes, but maybe I have more to say. Yeah, I Am I allowed to say more? No. Really? Yeah. It's your stream! <laughs> uh, well, we hope you guys are all having a happy Friday. It has been hot here. You could probably break an egg and make and you know that. Break a thing. maid? Yeah, Literally bed. take a maid and like break her over your knee? Yes. Have a vet from Clue just lying on the sidewalk? Oh. Oh. Uh, but before we jump into the time travel game, just want to give you guys a kitty update. Uh, our guest kitty, Tuna, um, we did get some bad news about her. Uh, she's got stage 2 kidney disease. Which might which, be the reason why someone let her go, sadly. Yes. The, the, which is a bitch. Uh, God, that, that. Um, we haven't made a decision what's going to exactly happen with her, but we do know that that means we will not have her for very long. We're waiting for one more test to give us an idea on just what kind of time frame she's at, how much time she's got, so we'll keep you guys posted when we know, and... Hopefully you all get to see her. Fingers crossed that we at least, you know, get a few months with her. You know, we'd like to make sure she she finishes off her days happy and mm -hmm. whole and loved. Yes. Mostly loved. So there is your kitty update. So the pressing stuff is over. Now we gotta go into this depressing game about time travel and destruction of the world. Not a depressing game. <laughs> we are playing Spirit Fairer. Spirit Fair was not. We knew all of this. Yeah, I was gonna of. say what, what, what? Grab the right save file. I believe so. Okay, so our next. We need to pull up our list of. Stuff. I'm pulling up our Corona. Hold on. I'm pulling it up so we can figure where we need to be. So the last ending we got was the new ending. Yep. <clears> okay, <throat> so we are looking for. We're going to go back to 600 AD. Hmm. 600 AD? We can't go back to 600 AD. We can only go to this. I think that's where we go. Okay. Because our next ending, we have to go back to medieval times. Ah. We're not ready to go to the yeah. okay. distant past. Hey, buddy! Oh, okay. For your next time, like, progression, like, we... No, that's not where progression was. Hi, Jackson. You heard me talking about a kitty and decided you need to make an appearance? near a cave in the mountains to the west. Spies, humans. Or ears. There's the meaning of the Siri chanting. is purring hmm. and whapping RG. It's so this is great. Glowing. Is there something else here? Oh, was there 
anything with the statue? I don't think so. I don't remember just, there being Was anything. it just plot? I think it was just plot. You would like to lay with us, Jackson. You can. Come on. Okay. Okay, Jackson is comfy. A wild Jackson is comfy. I find it funny that Robo and Marley both have max health and Wuton still doesn't. But I think that's because of the items we gave him. You know what? Look up his arm. Feel like we're not the best one? There's something, like, it's not doing all that much damage. Oh, hello, uh, Weeaboo! Welcome, welcome. Thank you for the follow and hello. <laughs> we're here to see someone stream New Game Plus. Yeah, we, we're going for all endings. Yep. Well, people I mean, were asking for it, so... Well, the people that are asking for it aren't showing up anymore, which is funny. Oh, they just got bored of us. Yeah. Think they are dead. You think? They, you, you, you don't think they could possibly have survived that? <laughs> I mean, look at them. You, you're sure they couldn't possibly have survived? Oh, we won't have to wait for the stupid beetles to dig in frickin' prehistoric times. Oh, for all the items? Yes. No, we get to just go under. Here to see what others think of the other endings, since I'm only used to seeing people get ending one and be done. Uh, so far, we, hmm, we had money reactions. Well, Hydra missed the one she actually wanted to see. The Dream Team ending is, like, it's a boring ending, but it's also, like, those it's, are the developers, yeah. it's... In a way, messages from the past, if you think about it. It's actually kind of a cool ending. Yeah, nowadays, like, the older it gets, the more it's like, again, it's a time capsule of, like, the people that made this game and their thoughts at the time. The new ending was kind of cute, but meh. Uh, the frog ending was just kind of a goofy frog ending. The frog ending's awesome, though. <laughs> it's just so out there that you just, like... Uh, yeah, it's... I like the frog ending. It's, it's cute. But I like how they make Marley, mm -hmm. uh, you know, croak. Yeah. Uh... Hey, best equipment for Robo. What arm does he have? Teraton. Teraton. When you say ending, you mean ending 13, right? No, no. It was considered ending 5. It was... The well, N-U... And it, it's ending. the one where all it is is the uh, credits roll by, and then there's like a new and yeah, one of the, the cre dolls. Yeah, the creature new. Yeah. And one of the frogs? Or it, it was a frog and the doll. Ah. I think we might have missed his best gear. Alright. I'm seeing the best weapon being Apocalypse Arm. Oh, yeah, we do definitely do not have that. That explains why he's not really doing super a lot of damage. We have to go back and get that one. You mean, yeah, new and you. Seriously? I mean, it's kind of hard to compare all weapons to the rainbow sword, because that's like the most powerful weapon in the game. <laughs> so where what? Oh, wait, hold on, never mind. Ignore the thing about Apocalypse's arm. That was okay. apparently exclusive to the DS release, so ah. it's not in this one. They get all things. I'm just used to hear someone mentioning new. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what is the one we have? Terraton. 
Archer. Looks like there's one that's stronger called the Dragon Arm. Okay. And then there's the Crisis Arm, which is inflicts damage based upon last digit of HP. Hmm. We have the Crisis Arm. So somehow we missed the Dragon Arm. Let Wait me see if that one's Atta in. One last digit. The Apocalypse is in the Steam release? Okay, then we missed it. Oh, well, no biggie. I did not. Uh, I just, okay. Thank you for the information. Attack. Last digit. Okay, we're going to just try this and see what happens. Yeah, where the hell? But we definitely did loot, miss the dragon arm. The cat is trying... The cat in my lap is trying to find... Uh, is trying to do the searching for me. Hmm. The Steam port and the DS port are identical. Oh, I thought this was based off the mobile port. Yeah, because doesn't the DS have additional dungeons? Oh, so we will get the we'll get the apocalypse on later. I okay. want to double check that. I could have sworn because we didn't okay. go through the additional dungeons on this. That's something we missed. <laughs> Did it have much for an additional dungeon? I never actually played the DS port, so I don't know. I know that some of them did add additional dungeons and such. When was it done by booting up the completed file? Hmm. Oh, okay. Ah! Hey, see, we're learning stuff. We are learning. Yay, learning. <laughs> we always appreciate getting more knowledge. Okay, so. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so since we didn't go back into the file, we just went right to New Game Plus. Okay. Assuming they're really... Oh, oh, there we go. The so other gonna... bonus... So, it's be, because we didn't go to Lost Sanctum, that's why we missed the other... The dragon arm for Robo. Okay, it all makes sense now. We weren't going crazy. Ro you see? Robo did have a better weapon. Mm -hmm. We just didn't get it. Actually, this one's not too bad. Think now. you're going to struggle with this? No. But it's, you know... Hi. Considering we're still at a point where, like, one-shotting everything. Hi. You didn't one-shot it, you failed. Is there a triple tick with these two? Oh, it's a lifeline. Okay, so... Dragon Arm Sanctum Apocalypse Vortex. Hmm. <laughs> you know, it always did one of the things that I actually think makes this game more charming. There we go, that killed it. Wait, what's Chrono's best weapon then? Probably a challenge weapon. Uh, say, what cracks me up about and well, I whoa, love there was... about games that this old is you get like a handful of different um, sprites and that's it. And they keep <laughs> reusing them. Yeah. Dream Seeker. I like the name. Splish. So it all goes back to that ending 13. Well, guess what? I guess we gotta get ending 13. All the good stuff is in ending 13. <laughs> hey, you. Oh, I bought his wife an apple. With what we earned today, that's all you earned is enough for an apple? Maybe apples are very expensive in this world. The Do you dude, see a bunch the of dude's apple trees? machines paralyze his wife, and all he can afford is an apple. <laughs> uh, 
Pretty sure you can see the joke about Dreamseeker and it being first in the DS release. Oh, a joke. I like jokes. You know, I wonder if those are the additional dungeons. Or what, whatever those time gates are. Oh, well. Uh, we have to... Where the hell do we go now? We have to go back to the... Middle Ages, I think? Yeah, I think those are the vortexes. Yeah. All right, so when do we have to go? Yeah. So you go back to the Middle Ages. Okay. We are looking... We need to... We, we come back before... That's what I thought. We come back before Tata is... We have to do it while, ta, while people think Tata is still the hero. Okay. So before we take the uh, metal. Okay, so we need... Okay, okay. As soon as he fucking fly. Yep. Just hear Luca's. You want to hear Luca's music? She has cool music. I'm not the biggest fan of the character, but she does have cool music. She has cool. It's like victory music. It really is. They should it's have just music. used it as victory music. It would have worked. Mm-hmm. Would have been. It kind of has that Final Fantasy yeah. victory music sound. The fanfare. Yeah. Do, 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 do. That was pretty much all of them. You are not worth my time, really. <laughs> this is good music too, so I'm trying to get to the bridge, I believe. Yeah, the bottom one I think is where Tata yeah. is. Well, no, we have to do the battle on the bridge. Oh, then we need to bring him his, uh... Oh, the provisions. Yeah, that's right. He needs the food from the chef to know that everything's gonna be okay. Trying to play a ROM hack of this. Oh, this is it a good ROM hack? Hey, for the longest time, that's all you could play was ROMs of this. Oh, it's you again. <laughs> What is with your strange golem? Yeah, I love how nobody ever really questions Robo. Mm -hmm. If I were to do a remake of this game, I think one, you wouldn't want to do too much to it, necessarily. I mean, you could add a couple of um, maybe side quests to expand some characters, I suppose. Bunch of cut but, in original content. But I think I'd want a few reaction, like weird reactions to Robo. Yeah. Just like casuals, like, hey, this is your trash can, right? <laughs> you are things mm -hmm. like, you know, just little goofy. Uh, uh, I think the most you get is like in the prehistoric times. I think Isla says some stuff. Make the game harder. Yeah, that's something after a while, a lot of RPGs had stuff like that. I always believe that it that I want to know how difficult it is to add hard mode to games. Like to me, it seems like it should just be some programming so that everything you know increases in level. Um. So I so I like the I always like the idea of games having a harder difficulty. Unfortunately, usually option. to make a game harder, you have to kind of like cheat or come up with rules to yeah. challenge yourself. I know, like, RTSs, they basically, they can't really make the AI better, usually. They have to make it so it can cheat. In these type of games, they usually have to make the enemies, like, they up, you would up their defenses, their attacks, maybe make them quicker. can't just increase level and be done with it. You gotta know how to strike a balance so it's hard but fair. Yeah. But, but, but why do you want it to be fair? Let the computer cheat. <laughs> just kidding. Uh, 
Now it poked me. Hey, Aurora. He's in a pickle. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> you guys can't see this, but our other cat just came up and attacked the cat on my lap's tail. Hmm. <laughs> so now I got a cat off. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh my. Oh boy. <laughs> or you have a persona issue. One of our uh, original uh, co-players was a big persona fan. Was? <laughs> he still is. He's not, not here. He's not here. He lives in Japan, so he no longer counts. As a person? Yes. I didn't realize you lost your person card when you went to Japan. Yes. Now, is there a time limit on how long you, you, you keep the person card before they take it from you? <laughs> or is it just, you go to Japan, you're no longer a person? To, it, he's <laughs> no longer a person now. Death. Death. Here's a fight at the cutscenes. The frog yep. is in the cutscene, but not in the battle. Yep. You might need to go check on the kids. Nah, you saw my MP, bitch! <laughs> I think it's the other town. I know, I just wanted to sleep so I could get all my MP back. He lost his people privileges. That's exactly. right. Exactly. I'll tell Walk that next time he pops on the stream. Walk, you are no longer a person. You have lost your people privilege. Oh, Grover wasn't in bed that time. No, he was sleeping at the foot. Like a cat. See, right there, you could have had a funny scene like, I'm sorry, but your, mm -hmm. your pet needs to sleep on the floor. All right. Just so like a random now, comment. I'm trying to remember where the hell Down. we go. Okay, do we go into the forest? No, you need to... We find out... I think we need to find out about... Tata here? Tata? Yeah. Because I know you go into the forest and then Frog's in his... Let's say right here. Okay, yeah. Save. Case. Let's see what the file name is. Fiendish Folk. The nope. Hero the Hero appears. We can go back now. Oh, okay. We can go to fight. This is where we... Uh, oh, okay. This is next ending. Alright. Back to the canyon. So we are going for ending, I want to say six, I think is the number of this one. We'll know after we get it if I, my numbers are right. You are still not worth my time. Ow! Ow! You flung a rock at me. Okay. <laughs> Our kitties are... I don't know what our kitties are doing, but they might knock over the webcam, so... Hey, hey, you too, knock it off. <laughs> the kitties are doing something. They're playing, I think. Okay, come here, you. You gonna go back to the fair? No, we can go to the levels right here. Do you want to fight all the extra lava stuff? The fair was a quicker battle. Is it? Yeah, remember that you when last time we did the bucket, we had to go through that whole first form. Yeah, I thought you had to go through the first form in the fair, too. I don't think so. All right. We didn't have to for the other ones. One of the things that ROM Hack I'm playing does, ROM Hack called T Plus, but was curious, is allowing me to do some prehistory stuff before. Mm. Ooh, interesting. Go to the radioactive one. <laughs> All right, lovers time. We start here, but we start after the remember the transformation phase. Yeah. Okay, so it's harder, but not as quick, or but quicker.
I like how it's it's become so casual now. <laughs> this is quicker than the bucket. Yeah, that's what I that's what I thought. I thought the bucket always makes you go oh, through the pattern. Oh, that goes pattern. through the... Okay, I didn't know that. I know the patterns do take a while. Because we did the bucket one time, <laughs> and it had the patterns. I think the only disappointing thing is that the Lagos fight really doesn't change each time you go no. in. No. <coughs> Excuse me. Though it is still cool that there's so many endings in this game. Mm. I mean, for a game from 95... Yep. Yeah, <laughs> almost kind of becomes a casual thing in New Game Plus. Yeah. He really, he does. Our, our artist time was that first end, was that second end. Especially ending. when we loaded the, the wrong file and we actually ended, went in with weaker characters than we ended the game with originally. So we loaded the wrong file and we were trying to do ending three which is the one where you fight him right at the beginning of the game. And we were we were struggling pretty good. We finally looked up some stuff to figure out if there was other ways to fight him, and we finally beat him. And after we beat him and loaded him and pulled back up the files, we realized we had grabbed a weaker file, yep. that, which is why we had none of our inventory that we had bought at the end of the game. <laughs> so we had, like, three... Uh, mega elixirs and like yeah we, it was it was an interesting fight <laughs> yeah if we'd had all of our right gear we might have been able to solo with chrono oh yeah that becomes pretty easy after a while there we go that ah, ah maybe Oh, you did save before we came yes. in here, right? Yes. Because we'll have to load that file again. You saved it around the bucket, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. If not, it's like it five minutes. It wasn't that far yeah. back. Because you had saved, and that's yep. how we had Here checked. comes the cool boss. This boss music, though, was actually always kind of cool to hear. When you're fighting Cell, pre-Cell mm -hmm. from Dragon Ball Z. Because they're done by the same artist. No, wasn't it post? This came or, out after Dragon Ball Z. Ah, uh, close enough. Yeah, but I... I don't think it came out during the Cell Saga. I don't know. How, I don't know. When, yeah. Remember, I, all I know is I remember we looked up Dragon Ball Z and it was like 80... Like 6 or something? Mm -hmm. Where he invented... Where he came up with it or whatever? Where it first came out. So I don't know where Cell Saga fell in. Hmm. In the grand scheme of things. I'm glad someone else thinks that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No, it's it's pre-Cell. It's freaking Cell from DBZ. You mean more? You mean people don't think that? <laughs> I mean, there's very little about that that doesn't scream sell. Playful mood tonight. Ah, she could be. I just saw her wiggle her butt. Hmm. I don't know what she's playing with, but I saw the cat butt wiggle. <laughs> but there wasn't a shack. <laughs> Cell Saga became before this. Okay. Oh, okay. So, so he took his design for Cell and then modified it for this. Oh no! Boobies of Doom! <laughs> 92. See? Hey, Weeaboo knows. No, he knows his stats, his history, his stuff. At least when it comes to Chrono Trigger and Akira Toriyama. <laughs> the nipple lasers, yeah. Oh, God, the nipple lasers. Oh, I know what I'm doing. Where is it? Oh, Danny boy, the pipes, the pipes are calling. Hey there, Raven. Hello. Is the singing a good thing? Funnily enough, DBZ was why I got into Chrono Trigger. Hey, that there is nothing wrong with that. Oh, no, he did his dark will. Uh, Dragon Ball 
was probably was actually a lot of probably one of the reasons I got into Dragon Quest. I always wondered why they didn't just put a curator Amazon right next to a Dragon Quest ad and gone, Hey guys, guess what? <laughs> I felt like I always thought it would sell themselves. <laughs> I mean it's a thing. <laughs> As a kid I said, the art reminds me of DBZ, I wanna play it. <laughs> yep. Yeah, like I said, I you put a cure you put Dragon Ball Z next to her, any games that Kira Toriyama is, was a part of, and I feel like, you know, right there, you just you just sell a bunch. You might need to throw the ball for her. Suck it! Our kitty is going insane. Ew, he dark flamed braced. Like go. There we go. Like, damn, game almost froze there. Dragon Ball Xenoverse games. Ooh, is this gonna drop Robo? Oh. You know what? I should pull up chat on my phone nope. so I can at least okay. try to talk to you guys while I'm playing with the cat. So apparently this is a thing now. Okay, what is... No, you know what? Gonna... Don't get it. Dragon Ball Xenoverse games, they came out, what, 100 years ago and they still making DLCs for what? them? Hey, hey! That's 85 years ago, sir. <laughs> They're making DLCs for two anyway. Hmm. It even has the same, like, thing Cell did. It's made up of all the DNA of everything on the planet. Hey. So. <clears throat> they were sitting there and, like. Wait a minute. Is Chrono a Saiyan? <laughs> Is that why he's so strong? There you go. You figured it out. Is this just a different planet in the DBZ universe and Chrono is a lost Saiyan? You figured it out. <laughs> Slight difference. So I'm kind of, I walk over here to watch the game and chat with you guys. Hmm. And, uh... Well, because I'm in I can. Here. The cat is bringing back the ball, putting it down, and then sitting really cute behind huh. it until I come back over. <laughs> Six years ago, millennia, tomato, tomato. <laughs> Cell was made from the DNA of the strongest fighters found on Earth at the time. Lavos is made from everything. Hmm. So actually, Lombos is the true cell. Yes. So I'm still going with Chrono's actually a saying. Here we go, mind blown. Chrono, this whole planet is the Saiyan homeworld. Then and that Chrono means... is actually Goku's dad. Or like, just, you know, grand, great great grandfather or something or other. <laughs> I'm dancing in the background. Huh. <laughs> DBZ's on Crunchyroll only makes that more apparent. <laughs> Is 
making sure I get my exercise today. Slapped Marley. Mm -hmm. I should waste the cam. Probably only seen half my face. Ow, that was a spanking. Even allows you to get Isla early. Oh, Ooh. nice. There you go. I am permanently on the party. Just so you can have the cave girl whomping everybody. Actually, it's going to be a waste, but you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and do it. No, I'm not. Now you're not. Well. It's going to be a waste of a mega elixir, but we have 11, so. Just to get everyone's MP back. <clears throat> That does actually more than Luminaire. Let's see. Eh, not really. Woo! Got him. Like you said, after a while it becomes so casual. I didn't even have to give you any help. Okay, let's see this ending. Mm -hmm. Let's see the ending, 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 ending. <clears throat> A legendary hero achievement unlocked. No ending. Apparently it's just Robo's music. <laughs> oh, I have no memory of this one. There's a bell. Uppercut it. It just moved on its own. Oh, there's Lady Robo. Oh my god, it's trying to get in the Robo Trigger. Oh, so Chrono and Marley we just are kill a god. We just kill God like being a normal Tuesday. Chrono and Kirby killing God casually. 
<clears throat> Except Kirby does it with a semi truck. <laughs> You've ever seen that ending? Look it up. That's Cur uh, Kirby and the for and uh, for forbidden for forgotten for land. Forgotten land. The ending Defeats of that is awesome. Defeat. Yeah, you talk about a freaking anime ending. Defeating a god with a semi truck. This is a, like basically the little happy robo ending. It's he goes back, everyone's happy. He gets his girl. Gets his girl, his robo girl. We won't go into the specifics of that. Maybe Aww. it's like Futurama. She's cute. I said maybe it's like. Well, you Futurama. see, the future is not so bad in this ending. Yeah, in a way, this is almost like because at the normal ending, you're worried about how Robo's actually gonna live. This ending, you. And this is okay. almost like the ending of that. Here we go. Look, there's Tata. Yep. Running past the king and queen. And Taban, for some reason, is there. Oh, no, that was his dad. That they just Tata's used the same sprite. Dad. Tata's bad dad, Taban. Taban. And then he dies. Here comes Tata at the castle. They're not showing us what happened. Oh, dear. Why'd the music turn Which dark? just goes to show you, anyone can use the Masamune. Is it the Masamune that he has? I actually, he has the metal. Tata the Hero Magus! It's Chrono. <laughs> I knew it! It was Vegeta <laughs> all along! Okay, so that's the acid trip ending. Okay, can't switch to Isla to test if they gave her magic yet. But I did get Dreamstone super early. She there gets, you go. She gets dinosaur magic. Summon dino. That actually would have been cool. Except tech... Okay, it's weird because she rides dinos. Because they ride the pterodactyls, but they fight the reptites. I guess you can argue the reptites and dinosaurs are actually different species. So there we go. There was the Tata ending. Voodoo Tata. So that was ending number six. Let's see where I uh, better load be. So that... Okay, so we're back, heading back to 600. So this time we are waiting <clears throat> until we want the hero medal. So we're going after we get the hero medal. Mm. Still not worth my time. Okay. You want to go play with the cat? You want me to, or did you wear her out? I don't know. She's somewhere in there, I think. Of course, I don't remember where I'm going. Where am I going? Uh, Do we need to go visit the Frog? Bridge. Do we need yeah, to visit? we haven't talked to Frog yet, so. We need to talk to Frog? Yeah. Hello, frog. Okay, bye, frog. Nice knowing you. 
Oh, we may, we may need that. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter because there's the new, new Rana. The enemies, like if they have clubs, you need to use fire on them. But I think we're hitting hard enough. I don't know if it really <laughs> matters. Yeah. You find the cat and yeah, the ball. She's, she's, well, not the ball. She she's chilling. Okay, we talk to him, we come down here, we... Think we... Hmm. From hack to consume sustenance. Sustenance, sustenance is, is good. good. Jinx. Jinx. Double Jinx. Jinx again. <laughs> okay, I think we go up here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, we get money first. I think we can run from these guys. <laughs> we do it all the time. Yeah, it's actually fairly common. It's like we live together. <laughs> For eight years? Nine years? We haven't been living together that long. Hmm. We've just been together that long. Gotta dance the music whenever uh -huh. possible. exactly did he go? Didn't he? Did he, he just leaves. run through a wall? I think he leaves, but you still have to go get the... We need the hero badge. Yeah. I don't know why I'm collecting things. It's a habit. Because he dropped it, right? Yeah. Dodged you. Oh. You have to fight this group. Well, they need to just go away. <laughs> what did we do, like one point under or something? Yep. <laughs> hey, isn't that the guy we had to catch the stone from? Hmm. Remember that? Yeah. These birds think they're so cool with hmm. their swords and wings and stuff. Well, they're not. Mm -hmm. Ow! He scratched me! Huh. <laughs> These guys are annoying, and not in the annoying of 
annoying. You want, you're done. Just... <laughs> what the hell? How much alcohol is in this drink? You're drinking uh, water. Yeah, right. <laughs> Man. Yeah, this area was actually kind of annoying. I don't think you can run from any of this either. Sustenance break is over. Mm. Are you filled up to the bow to the back? I'm done. You're done. I can't talk You're apparently. Done. Bah. I just can't talk. You cannot. Can, can I get by you, Mr. Testing Out His Sword Swing? Nope. Nope. So we're actually going to run out of MP on uh, Chrono. That's fine. I think we can handle it. Right. I don't know, but we do have quite a bit of money, considering, and... Um, <laughs> Yeah, I think we can spare a few of those mid ethers. Yep. Just saying. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jesus. That guy's just like, that's a sky. Yep. Look at that beautiful sky. Totally. Oh, you know what? I can just use a... Shelter. Sure we have enough. I don't know. <laughs> you sure we can afford to drop down to 98? Right. Open it. See, look at that. We got more. We're already maxed out, so it doesn't matter. Did he just like whack Robo down? It. That's what it looked like. Oh. That. Uh, I know. It looks like you should be able to go into the cave. Yes, you can. Yeah. Yeah, Masai Mune. Wait. Shelters are infinite if you know where to look. Did you come to take the Masa Moon in? No. Really? That's all? That, that's You just bat, like push us away? Okay. I <laughs> thought we wanted the hero's badge. It's in the water when you hop down. Or you go back and talk to Tata, and I think he gives it to you. Well, either way, I think we're fine. I think we just have to, it's before we we forge the Masa Mune yeah. that we have to go back and do. Guardia Forest, there's a bush that you can take one out of. Hmm. So you just keep going back and hitting up that bush. Pretty tough. No shit. Right. <laughs> we rarely had to buy him. He has such tiny feet. It's like that guy from the messenger who skipped leg day. <laughs> he wants to pump you up. Oh, I guess I was on duo. Sorry. I wondered why Robo was using ice. 
Yeah, well, that's whatever. Hey, everybody got to attack! Woo! Everybody's special! Yep. Dead. Not big surprise. <laughs> yep. Too bad we're gonna have to go through the side quest to pump this up yep. if we want it stronger again. Yeah, actually, comedically enough, I think the weapon we have on Frog now is probably still stronger than the Masa Moon. <laughs> Talk to Tata. And he gives us the badge. What? D did we get it? I don't know. He walked out too quickly. And that won't matter because we had yeah, it from the do. last game through. took Masa Mune away from us from the last game period. Probably took the hero's badge, well, Don't too. you go and talk to Frog again? No. No? It's time for another boss battle. After you get the hero's badge? What's the save file? Uh, Tata yeah. and the Frog after you get the hero medal, or the rare red rock. Mm. So yes, we're heading back. Okay, what am I doing wrong about escaping? You have to hit the... There it is. <laughs> For some reason, it wasn't... That grew, or do you want to switch her out for Luca? Um, I'm fine with this group. Bottom. Oh. Hey, there's the kitty. Kitty came back. Now let's see if I remember how to do this. <laughs> okay. Wake me up when you end. <laughs> Aren't you gonna walk me through it? This is like our eighth time, f well, if you count all the times we kept screwing up originally, this is like our twelfth time fighting it. I think you have an idea what to do. Um. Are you sure you trust me? Yeah. What were you using for Robo? Uh, you either side heals or if I wasn't side healing, I was uh, using his fist attack. Rapid fire? Rapid fire fist or I had to combine him with Marley. Okay. Well, you know, actually, that happens. That happens. Actually, your problem is you're watching us. We break games <laughs> a lot. Oh, that was easy. 
mission accomplished. Something, something, let's go in. Raid! Uh-oh. Latalis is broke. It's a Latalis right. Raid! Hello, Latalis! I have to pull myself up now. Hello, hello! Let me get the let me get the welcome in. Welcome, welcome. What were you playing tonight? Oh, you were playing some sacred stones. How did it go? How did it go? And of course, Chad, you know we we know we welcome everybody in with a hype. So drop those emotes Something in happened. as we uh, as we welcome in everybody. Oops, hit it to walk off the game. Get the ultimate version of the music of the game. <laughs> Welcome in Raiders to the Crew Crusaders. I am right. I'm RG. And we are playing some Chrono Trigger New Game Plus. It basically means we are rushing to fight Lobos in a lot of different locations. He's the final boss of the game. And we are currently working on ending number seven of 13. Some randomized so. sacred stones. I was spending 30 minutes attacking a boss at range. The saying avoid zap so I can demolish any number of units from one range. Huh. Ooh, but randomized. That had to have been fun. That had to have been fun, though. But, yeah, spending 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've, I've played enough Fire Emblem to know how that goes. Okay, let's get this archer here. Oh, man, uh. he's doing, like, no damage. <laughs> Uh, but thank you for the raid, Latellis. If you need to go, you know, take care of some after stream stuff, rest, get some food, please, please go ahead and do so. Uh, we will take care of your community. As far as Latellis' community goes, there's always room on the futon. Bit busted in chapter So eight. Ha hang out with us and see if I can remember how to fight this boss we fought a lot of times already. Make sure to heal up and empty up. <laughs> I'm gonna get dinner, but I'll be back. Thank you. Enjoy foodage. Swordmasters plus throne avoid bonuses. A bit busted for chapter eight. Oh man. Sounds like you had a good time though, overall. Okay. Oh, the only thing I'd recommend during the fight, it may not really matter that much. Put a uh, magic defense on Robo with the uh, shield, uh, like barrier sphere, or shield sphere, whatever one is, and then put the physical one on Marley. You don't think it stacks anymore? It's not that I think it stacks. It's just that Robo has low magic defense. Marley has low physical defense. For those of you that are joining us, please enjoy this cool music for this boss. Now I can see if I can learn magic. We can even try to be quiet a little. So you guys can listen. Oh, after, and the nipple attack. After the boob attack. You always have to comment on the boobs of death. Start off with a heal. Just because Robo took quite a bit of damage. It's actually a big heal. It's like max heal everybody. So these two are the great ones. You don't need to worry about any other one person doing attacks, I guess. Jeez. Really is a good heal. Yep, you always comment on the nipple lasers. Okay, which one? Are you said magical? Yeah, for a robo. Oops, I think I did both on the same. Yeah. On oh, them well. both. Whatever. They probably don't need it that much. More nipple lasers. His electric cue is strong if you want to get that off. Oh. Next time. Is it? Yeah. That. See, I was playing with the cat when you were fighting with him. Yeah. So, how am I supposed to know what's going to fight the nipple yeah. lasers the best?
<laughs> I probably didn't need to haste, did I? Yeah, why not? Uh-oh. That's not good. There goes your uh, status defenses. Do you think that's really a fear at this stage? Mm, it could be annoying later on. Oh, I was hoping, I, I assumed Robo would take out that. Nope, still can't learn magic. Isla, not a smarty smart. Darn, it would have been great to have her summoned right on vehicle. Or right on dino. Right on dino. Right on dino. She does summon, she does summon dinosaur ass as her final attack. Futons out of MP. Wow, that actually does a lot. It does. Eh. See, now he's confused. Uh, doesn't she have a... Cure 2 might be able to do it. I'm not too worried. We've got so much health. I get her yeah, that the characters wait at when not in party so you can see them just resting on the beds. Oh, cool. doing it doesn't really do all that much i mean if, you, if you're not doing anything else with well, her might as well use it but it's not that impressive <laughs> okay i'm gonna use the combo heal Swap Chrono out of the party way sooner. Oh. And well, that could be different. That's nice, MP. actually, to be able to swap him. You know what? We're gonna get him back. Just make elixir. Yeah, we have 12 of them in every fight, or in uh, the final fight, so it's like, eh. Like I said, we're gonna get him back. He's confused again. There, he's dead. Yep. We're good. Or is he? Oh, he's dead. Totally dead. No, nothing to see here. What the fuck is that thing? That we've seen many times already, but yep. still. Can bring Island to fight Magus. <laughs> uh, I? I couldn't tell if I was on it. He has heal beam too, if you just want to heal him. Oh, whoops. Just realized I probably kicked that off too soon. Yep. Totally kicked that off too soon. Now we kick that off.
pure robo on her next time. He's not low low, but Are you worried? I haven't tasted Marley, yeah. I forgot. Not that it's doing any yeah. <laughs> too much harm, really. Weird little pairing. Yep. And the animation doesn't make you think it's gonna heal everybody. Yeah. Oh. Yep. You're gonna have to do the same thing I did. For after you just healed everyone the full, use the mega elixir just to give everyone their MP back. Actually, you're right. Should have just used the mega. Yeah. Elixir. Don't worry, I did that too. <laughs> God damn it! Got his defense back. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. I think we'll be fine. I want to heal Marley. Except that he didn't drop his defense back down. Sure. Give a second. He's a jerk! He's a meanie! How dare he! Yeah. There it is. Doesn't he know we're trying to kill him? He needs to make it easier on us. Feels like they're giving us a lot of turns this time. Well, I think we saw them on wait. Finally, give her haste. They're forgetting. Oh, did I back out of it? <laughs> Actually, this might still do damage. Yeah. Because he just rezzed. Oh, I was hoping. Interesting. I was hoping to see. Oh. Huh? Nothing. I chose to attack him. Oh, there goes your status immunity. Uh, that could suck. But maybe we're lucky. Are we lucky, Chad? Are we lucky? No. He's still got his ah. thing up. And yeah, that one. Has he dropped his thing yet? There it goes. I don't think it's restored. What? It was restored. So. You have to wait a second. Uh, I thought he'd already put his barrier back yeah. up. There it is. Stop 
shifting. Just keep healing. Mm -hmm. This fight is. Hey, there we go. Okay. It's done. Why don't you just ask me who Alex Jones is, and I don't know how to how I feel about this. Is it, that the? That's the crazy guy. Okay. That means your wife has been avoiding, you know, crazy people. <laughs> it's probably a smart thing. All right, Chet, we did it. New ending. Ending got. So we got the unknown past. See these people again. Character design by Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. <laughs> okay, so I know who you're referring to. Hey, look, we're still breaking and entering. Right? Hey, buttheads. <laughs> and they all start evil laughing, okay? <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. We really need to get rid of that arm war. <laughs> no kidding. And they're happy? Why are they all cheering and running out? <laughs> Is there a party? We're going to a party? Do you remember this ending? Uh, I don't know if it's the one I'm thinking of. Oh boy. Heck even adds the Octo Rider, which you can never usually fight normally. Hmm. What happens here? Because we haven't met Isla yet, technically. There's the reptiles. Looks like they're all going after them. They're chasing the reptiles. Kino and, and chasing is. the reptiles some more. And running from the reptiles. <laughs> I think Kino did a bad. Oh, now no, the reptiles. Yeah, I was to say it's gonna be Isla. <laughs> and Magus for some reason. Hello, I am Magus. With his DBZ villains. Hello, we are the king and queen and soldiers. And some guy that keeps trying to kill us. Yeah, the chancellor is pretty supped at this moment. And frog, hi frog. How are you doing, frog? Ribbit? Pretty much. <laughs> I don't see what happens to Robo in this ending. I guess you can say the other ending is actually what happened to Robo. All right, there's another ending. Woot woot. Okay, we've got another one before we get Frog. Another ending before we get Frog? Mm-hmm. Dear Lord. Um, we need to... Beat Lavos right after we return from our first trip to BC. So we There's will, Lava. we will see Isla. <laughs> yeah, you had some fun with that, didn't you? Yeah, <laughs> that was kind of fun. Did you ever beat your chest like the Robo? When I was like eight. Well, relive your childhood then. I'm playing a video game from like when I was a child. <laughs> That's how old this is, because I'm an old man. All right, that's another ending down. I was young when this was new. So that was ending number seven, the unknown past. Still, you got to beat Lavos immediately after going to the Red Rock. Yep. Before we before. Yeah, it's like oh, we have Oops. to go beat Lavos again. Uh. Okay, so this file is. Yeah. Tata and the frog. Yeah. Okay, so we need to go to. Do we B need to go back to 
Did we talk to Frog? Oh, do you want to talk to Frog again? I'm trying to remember, don't we need to do that first? I don't know, actually. No, don't we have to go back and talk to Malakwar? Yeah, didn't you? Go talk to... Well, he just said... Oh, we probably need to talk to him so he tells us what we're looking for. Yeah. I... Okay. Do we need to go find him in the uh, fair? I don't remember that we need to find him in the fair. Well, maybe we do need to talk to Frog first. Yeah, I didn't remember we had to go talk to Frog first. And I think somebody tells us about him. Yeah. Because we have to look on the blade, and it says Malakwar on the blade. Yeah, that's what it is. Hmm. Yeah. That's right. We remember things, just not in the right order. God, this becomes so much easier when you get the epoch. Yeah, especially because we need to run from this guy. Bye, losers. Brownie points if you know where the names Malakar, Jaspar, and uh, Balthazar come from. Battlestar Galactica. They are not in Battlestar Galactica. <laughs> Although there is a Bal Baltar in Galactica. There is no sound. Check our... Can you not hear us? Anyone else having sound issues? Um, I'm not seeing where there's any issues on... Anyone else? It might be on your end, Weeaboo. If need be, I'll go grab the... I'll go grab the headset. <laughs> No sound. Uh, Raven can hear us. Mallet. Isn't that the character's name? Malquire. It's probably Malkior. That actually sounds cooler. That's how I've always heard it pronounced as Malakor, but Malkior probably could be a more accurate pronunciation. Yeah, so we're just tell it fixing this. <laughs> Raven says we have no sound issues. Yeah, Mal I can see how it could be pronounced Melkir. Yeah. <clears throat> Anyhow, that's my question of the three wise men from the Bible. <clears throat> okay. I did a sound check anyway. Uh, it We're might good. be. Sure that's not like Asmodeus or Beezlebub? <laughs> Melchior. Oh, is that Mel how you God, Sacrifice was a good game. I think I've only heard that name. I don't know much about it. Excuse me for a second. No I just problem. got a weird message. We're going to have a guest. I'm just 
It's not delivery, it's DiGiorno. No, god damn it, I hit the wrong button. Like, oh god, I hope we don't have to go through meeting Isla. <laughs> Not ready for that yet. Showing our viewers. Ah, so Chad, you ever want to see what uh, four pounds of candy looks like? Wait a minute. I thought that wasn't coming till like August. It wasn't coming till August. It came early. That doesn't look like what we ordered. It's in the box. I gotta open the box. Chad, here you go. It's freaking, um, if anyone's ever seen Pulp Fiction, it's just like gold, a golden light coming out of it. Uh, Watch uh, it be rock hard. In case you guys are wondering what these are exactly, they're a Japanese candy called Haichus. Why do you need four pounds of candy? Haichus. Because. And this is one of our favorite, like, little sweet treats. It was cheap, and they don't go bad quickly. And that. They, it was actually quite cost-efficient to buy a huge-ass box of high juice. <laughs> so, there you guys go. I think it was four I think it was like four pounds. All said and done. And it wasn't supposed to show up for a while. So it was like, what? This is already here? I actually forgot we ordered that. Hey, Aurora... And the cat over. figured out already. Uh, our wallets. Actually, it wasn't that expensive. Willy Wonka, Raven. We had to take out Willy Wonka. And they aren't rock hard either. All right, now we need to go back to uh, prehistoric times. Ah. They are really good candy. want to kill with those death ah! by diabetes oh human and dinosaur traits well what was really funny chat is i went out there and i i got this message saying yeah your your package was delivered Oops. i'm like we didn't have anything coming and I walk out, and I open our gate, and I'm looking around and stuff, and I'm like, I'm still not seeing this I'll move package. The hell out of that one. I started walking away, and something told me to look up, and that's who it was above my head. They had put the package where I couldn't see it. <laughs> where did they put it? On top of the gate. Oh, okay. Like well, that's off one to way the to do side. It. <laughs> yeah. We don't have to go to the hunting range anymore either. Nope. Yeah, we're gonna watch the Isla. Yeah, sure. See, see, cave girl. Who 
put pants on the dinosaurs? Akira Toriyama. Akira Toriyama. In New Game Plus, you could have done this all solo. Yep. See those of ordinary humans. You know, it's Shaq Poo. Well, that's poo on you. Mm hmm. So, female is severely agitated, say provocation is inadvisable. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Bad touch! Bad touch! So, Chrono could be his. Go. So if Isla is Marley's ancestor, <laughs> and Chrono marries Marley, <laughs> if Chrono had relations with Isla, he's his own great 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 You strange person, but strong too. That is because I'm a robot. Robot. What ro robot? I do not know robot. A robot is a humanoid machine constructed by humans. Technically not a humanoid machine. To be a machine. What what you say? All your base are belong to us! No say word I do not know. Isla head go boom. Aww. I actually had a roar I hugged. Hmm. Not be formulated within the bounds of her understanding. Are you raiding the candy again? Yep. This is why we bought the candy, chat. <clears throat> when RG disappears, you'll know why. Yeah, I got too fat and died of <laughs> freaking diabetic coma. It's the way you would have wanted to go. I'll give you a mini, mini stone. Let me take a base, but I set you up a bomb. No! Go Zig! What? Uh, zero wing. Go Zig, go Zig. Oh! <laughs> yeah. eh. You eh. can't even get the food open! It's fighting me. I was gonna kill you! <laughs> Trixie. And I'm back to playing with the cat because the cat has insisted it's playtime. Hey everybody, you know what killed the dinosaurs? The Ice Age! Out! In a way, all the demographic and the age that maybe would fit in. Mm hmm. I don't know how many people actually recognize where it's from anymore. They just might remember it from the meme. What? Zero Wing. All your base are belong to us. It's on the uh, Switch now. Oh, the actual game? Yeah. Part of the Genesis expansion pass. Zero Wing. Go oh, zig, go zig, go zig. All your base are belong to us. Move zig, move zig. But yeah, it just got added like last month to the Switch uh, expansion pack on the Sega Genesis. There was a thing on Twitter about people now knowing where this meme came from. <laughs> Even Battle Network, by your base, that is.
Tape boogie. Okay, Boogie. Oh, it's time to cave, Boogie! Is this the most appropriate use of our time, the current situation? Let's have fun! So we're knowing so much about old trivia when a lot of it is more than 10 years older than me. That happens. Leo, they're having girl talk. I'm out of energy now. Well, someone's in the corner of the party. Being moody, like a teen. This fluid contains immeasurable impurities. Jump up in the air. She's not gonna slap her. There it is, slap that ass, Marley. Jump in the air, what's up, what's up, what's up? Slap that ass. Futon does not dance like Commander Shepard. Hey, you. I do not know this reference. If Who you is ever play, this Commander Shepard? If you Shepherd? play Mass Effect, you'll know the Commander Shepard dance. Well, I've only ever seen the speed run. Yeah. The uh, Commander Shepard's dance is, um... Uh, skull smash. And you're still gonna pass out, aren't you? Drink, 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 drink. Keep it up, Futon. Go, 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 go. God, you know how much you'd have to piss after drinking all that? Drink one more. Too strong, Futon. Four. Totally not alcohol. How did Robo get drunk? Good, good, good morning. It appears that liquid induces peculiar behavior in humans. Then what the frick were you doing? Slide fun. You also win this dream game by just losing and retrying a couple times, yep. You guys all slept on the ground and she went back into her hut. Mr. Reptile. Alright, who do we want to go with? Chat? Who do you want us to see? We've been rolling with Marley. We want Robo or Luca with us? Let's go with Luca. Robo is obviously trying to blend in. I am hip. I am with it. Daka 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 daka. No, take yours. Otherwise, we need you. I vote brains. All right, I'm assuming that's technically Luca. Hey. What, what weapon do we equip Isla with? Uh-huh. I mean, we could let her count her. Uh, are the cats gonna show? They're fine, they're fine, they're fine. They're fine. Don't you worry, they're fine. 
Arf, I love the fact that drunk Luca acts more like her dad. Yeah. <laughs> Doubles evasion, so if you want to run the missile. Yeah, let's give her the power and just have her hit like a freight train. Well, you, no, she kind of already does. Have her hit more like a freight train. Where would we have to go next? Down. Was it here we yeah. went? Okay, that's right. That's the forest maze. Do you want to take over? No, no, no. I, I just did my section. You can take over again. You know what you do? Wait, wait. Is this the line? What, where if Isla gives birth, she dies? <laughs> yes. What's well, strict. No way Isla hits. Give thing back two time. Kino I man, I let die. I let have baby. Then Kino chief. I said. <laughs> I was one time. I said. Such a I let have baby. <laughs> I let die. Exactly. You don't know what we're talking about. Yeah. Like, what, she, gives, she dies when she gives birth? Yeah. Talk about zero population yeah. growth. Oh, it's so great that you knew which com which line we were looking for. Such a great line. Like, it's hilarious in its, in its greatness. Red wife, wife good, wife had baby, kill wife, wife gone, regret. <laughs> That's how I always interpret Isla's line about having a baby. <laughs> I can see it. Oh, there's a bridge. It's actually kind of amazing how fast the this game goes. Stupid monkeys. In New Game Plus. Yep. Like, it really actually makes you feel like this game really is short. But God, it still looks so great. Mm -hmm. And it's plays still so well after all this time. Well, it's... this style of graphics, they aged a lot better than the, like first 3d graphics take a look at the original final fantasy 7 and tell me how it looks nowadays or golden eye oh god yeah golden eye golden eye on the n64 has not aged well nope but then something like wind waker aged amazing yeah so there is there is stuff that ages very well even ocarina of time which looked freaking beautiful when it first came out i was like eh. yeah yoshi's story actually doesn't look too bad I played that uh, last weekend. Was it last weekend on hmm. stream? That actually aged pretty well. Pixels age way better than the 3D bearing cell animate, bearing cell shaded or well polished 3D. Yep. Yeah, it's true. I'm actually liking the. Um, what is it called? The 2D HD? I think so, they're calling like it. Like when they're making games in this style, but modern day? Yeah. They're, they're modernized for today, but they're still using a lot of the pixel stuff. Like uh, Octopath Yeah, is that style. 
I actually like that style because I like the pixel animation myself. I always like this, the look of the pixel stuff. The, the, the collector in me is twitching every time we run past a chest. You know I'm just like, I want to grab all the chests, but we don't need the chests. <laughs> God, God, we don't have to wait for these shitheads. We just need to go down that hole? Yeah. Because an issue with a lot of 3D is that if it is flawed, yeah. It's a lot more noticeable if you don't know how to hide it. Ah. I love the dinosaurs dancing too. <laughs> You don't remember where to go, do you? You know the pit the cutscene gave them pants, but that is clearly a green Rep ass. That's reptile ass. Here. Just for you. <gasps> Yay! We got stoned! There it is. Because <laughs> there's actually a lot of corners that are cut in 3D environments. They're just hidden by clever camera tricks. All I know is, see, all I can tell you is I broke the game a lot less in a pixel game than, I have, than we have in a lot of these 3D mm -hmm. games. Like, how many times did we break Dead Rising? Yeah. How many times did we break Uncharted? Yeah. <laughs> Lego Marvel? Yeah. <laughs> uh, we've got a small track record with finding ways to break games. Completely oh. accidentally. I was like, we don't find a way to break them, it just happens. Latalis has returned. Hey, Latalis. <laughs> you like uh, four pounds of candy? <laughs> I like a burr. It's all high chews. We, uh, it was more cost efficient to just buy a big box mm -hmm. that we could gradually eat than buying the little small packages. And it just showed up, which surprised the heck out of us because we thought it wasn't supposed to come for like another month. <laughs> See, you know what we're talking about. Yeah, <laughs> Latalis is in the know. <laughs> I choose her the yep. best. <laughs> yeah, we ordered the box off Amazon. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. And yep. dead. And dead. And a boot to the head. And a boot to the head. <laughs> and for Azalea, a boot to the head. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, they're the rulers of the world, huh? Something tells me that's not true. <laughs> <laughs> I love that, just blah. Yep. <laughs> blah. Okay, now did we get the dreamstone? No. That is Isla. When do we have to go fight Lavos again? As soon as we get back. Oh, okay. That's why I asked if we had the Dreamstone. Ah. Because we do it before we, um... Hey, everybody, you know what killed the dinosaurs? Oh, no. The Ice Age! He did it again, Jet! <laughs> um... After you return from your first trip with the gate key and before repairing Masamune. Yeah, so right now, basically. <laughs> That's right, ma'am. Ma'am. No, you you want to fight it. him? Oh, girl. Get You're dark. better at it than I am. You did one fight. Yeah, oh, and I know from one that. fight that you're better at it than I am. Delta Force. I'm actually not going to switch to Robo, but... You want to hear his music? I want to hear his music. Seriously, one of the best things for this game is the music, and I will never... No one can say otherwise. Yep, there, there's, there's the, the title change. We wanted that. So the save files changed to the Masamune. So go to the fair. Okay, who's ready for the boss fight again? Again. Boss fight! <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think, you know what it'll tell us? I think they do call it all endings. Or something. You know, I'm not quite clear on all the rules, but yes, actually, it is. It is all endings. <laughs> Oh, we need to switch Luca's equipment. She's confused. Oh, we never gave her anything? Well, oh well. Yep. Here we go. I want to play this. <laughs> Luca just, yeah, when Luca's confused, she just goes insane, right? Yep. <laughs> She just laughs manically when she's confused. She, she is why you are always worried about the smart ones. Mm-hmm. Because you never know what they're, how they're going to act when they snap. Looks like the next ending is pretty much right after this, too. <laughs> Seems like so, a lot of these Lavos endings are really close together. 
Yep, they are. I mean, this is like the fourth one without mm -hmm. Prague. Okay, change your gear here. Yep. I just love Marley's line. We're in pretty deep. That's what he said. Okay, here we go. It's time to get on with the show. And see this cell wannabe strip on us. Strip? Well, he, he opens. Does, he, does, he does flash us. He, yeah, they, okay, there we go. Flash. That's probably a better word. If you're sensitive to nipples, look away now, chat. Right. He always opens with it, too. Yeah. And open! <laughs> <laughs> there we go. He's just getting his flash dance on. <laughs> you make fun of my Ice Age joke. Hey, at least mine was original. Yeah. So hot. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, this is where pretty much Chrono's gonna be doing all the work. Yeah. No, no, uh, Luca can throw out a lot of firepower. So, when are you gonna start learning this fight blind? So we can put a blindfold on you. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> I have a life. Actually, that makes me wonder could you actually do the Lavos fight blindfolded? Oh, yeah, easily. I mean... It's not that hard to do RPGs blindfolded. Well, you'd have to memorize the menuing, which would be tricky at times. Because mm -hmm. it's not like you could reorder the uh, yeah. abilities. But huh. it, there is cues... But there is a little RNG in this fight. Even now, I kind of now I'm curious. I want to see if anyone's done blindfolded Lavos through the internet. You're looking at porn, are you? Well, considering I'm typing in blindfolded Lavos, that mm -hmm. could. The, 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 I'm not going to rule out the internet on that hmm. one. No, I wonder. Yeah, I wonder how much does this do? Triple tech! Tech, 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 tech! tech. Not that much. Okay. Doesn't seem like many of the triple techs really. Yeah. The power of triangles to save us! Exactly. Yeah. Triangle power! It's like Flare actually did more damage than that. Yeah, I don't think anyone's ever done a Lavos fight blindfolded.
Yeah, so it does feel kind of like one you could learn to do blindfolded with enough practice. It, you couldn't tell it's almost dead. Well, you'd have to... Uh, <laughs> Spiky-haired kid with katana created yep. an alien planetary parasite. We're sure he's a Saiyan. We, we're now, this our is... new, our new lore is that Chrono is the first Saiyan. That this is actually the Saiyan homeworld. And I, Goku th just comes later. That's your lore. I was just saying this is a planet in the DBZ universe and that Chrono's actually a lost Saiyan. If you wanted to be the first Saiyan, that works. I feel like he could be related to Goku. I mean, look at him! Mm. <laughs> the only difference is he doesn't have black hair. <laughs> Maybe the gene for red hair started to slowly fade over time in the race. <laughs> hey, I'm running with this theory. It's a game theory! Woo! <laughs> now you're gaming with power and theories. I wonder if anyone's ever written a book of just like all the various theories people have for games. Probably. I mean, there's plenty of that on the internet. Yeah. Hey, on the plus side, after this, we get Frog back. We best boy. Mm-hmm. That's ah, whispering. Rainbows. Frog as best boy is something I understand the sentiment for, but cannot agree with. That's okay. Everyone is allowed their own opinion. Even if it's wrong. <laughs> Damn, it's fighting words, RG. That's fine. God, I'm so glad we figured out this frenzy thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow, I just yawned. I'm not feeling that tired anymore, though. <laughs> as wrong as it may be, I will stand by Magus. Well, well, then you should have been here when we were playing the main playthrough. Yeah. Chat made, yeah. Chat made us kill Magus. I didn't want to. Chat, Chat made the decision for us. And then I went and juiced Frog and did the one-on-one -on -one fight. And beat the crap out of him. But this time we have to keep Magus alive. This time we do have to keep Magus alive. So chat doesn't get to overrule us this time. Oh, and Frog isn't a little whiny brat that's killing people because his sister died. <laughs> Just pointing that out. <laughs> I never thought Magus was that whiny. You know, having seen him again, he's not so much whiny, just like really kind of emo-ish. Or not emo, like, just moody. He's really moody. And then it's like, oh, look. I got bad stuff happened. Oh, oh it's conflicted. Uh-oh. <laughs> Honestly, I think the story is better if you can, if you take into account that Frog spares Magus. Like, that Frog is not controlled by this idea of vengeance and sees the bigger picture. He doesn't have a chance to. 
He never has a chance to, like, cut his head off. Let's see. But it was the idea that he, that Magus was dead after that. It's that's hinted why he eventually... at. It's hinted at. It's not confirmed, but I think it's hinted at. I mean, in fairness to Magus, he was a kid. Yeah, I would agree with okay. that. Okay, he was a kid at the time. You're right about that. But then he becomes the leader of a group of monsters and then leads attack and kills humans so he can fight Lavos? In his own way, maybe he was trying to save the people. Because, I By... mean, if he killed Lavos, it all would have ended too, just like you guys did. I mean, in one... Oh, wait. And, and as we boo points out here, he was ripped away from his timeline, so he didn't even know how to get back necessarily. That's true. All he knew was Lavos. But that doesn't, you know, give you the permission to raise an army of monsters to go attack and kill innocent people. Oh, and turn a knight into a frog, and, or kill a knight, then turn a dude into a frog while laughing at him. Yeah, this is not a nice person. Hey, I never said <laughs> he got raised properly after that. That is true. You can argue raised. He gets raised by monsters. He knows nothing else. That is true. All he knows is these actions should eventually lead him to... Whoa, she died. ...to, you know, saving his sister. Whoa. No, that yeah. is that is a good argument. I will agree with that and, one. And yeah, I knew about that one. The, that Magus is canonically alive. Yeah. In Chrono Cross, so. So is Glenn, technically, if I recall. I actually, I've not gotten to play Chrono Cross. I actually am thinking about purchasing it to play. Because years ago, I was told it wasn't great, and then people said it's actually got him. It's one of those games that bad. actually isn't as bad as some people were saying back when it came out. And it doesn't give him any permission. It doesn't make him nicer, but the monsters did give him lodging and help him out. True. True. You can argue that the monsters honestly, did help him. Honestly, I think there's that arguments. I think there's honestly arguments for both sides of the story, and that's yeah. what makes it work. Is you can hate Magus or you can love him, and there's reasons for both. <laughs> and the Zeal people never cared about humans to begin with. The Zeal people. The oh. the people that were in the sky. They were human, though. But they, they didn't were care about the people on land. No, they were they were magically... It, it's like the X-Men. Uh-oh. I really enjoy it. It's just that people want to live up to Chrono Trigger, which is basically impossible with nostalgia goggles. It's true. Yeah, I can understand that from Chrono Cross. Also, yep. Chrono Cross is a good game, just not Chrono Trigger, which is yep. fine. See, that's what... I've been... I've actually heard that, so... Because it was more, it was really more of a spiritual successor than a true sequel, from what I understand. It has a, it has certain things that that make it a sequel, I guess. But it's not really. At least that was what I. That's how I understood mm -hmm. Chrono Cross. And the point is, Chrono Cross is a good game, just not what people wanted. Considering people wanted more Chrono. And dead. Hey, new ending. Okay, guys, we got a new ending again. And a boot to the head. And a boot to the head. Man, we really should have that as a sound alert. Here we go. We haven't done this one today. Didn't play. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Dimensional shenanigans. <laughs> yeah. Tiny, Tiny whiny. Tiny whiny. I like that. I am old. I have a hammer. Oh, no, was that a drink? I can't remember what he was holding. I think that was Hey! Hard. How you doing? How you doing? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Who? 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 I can dance. That one's actually dancing. Is that Flea? Might have been. No, I think those were the, ah! the <laughs> dancers at the end. Look at yeah. there's Flea. Hi, I've got a hat. Hi, I'm a lamppost now. That's never explained. <laughs> the kitty. The runners. We exist, but you never met us. Hey yo. There is a character I'm surprised they didn't try and bring back again. Oh well, there you Speaking were talking about. Speaking of young Magus. Hey. They should hack the ROM to play as a uh, Scala. That'd be interesting. Definitely worth buying. Yep. 
Well, we actually might buy it on Switch. If, if I get it, I'll probably get it on Switch. That's oh, why I've been hot, eyeing hot, it. Hot, 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 hot. I'm ready! I'm ready! Let's go make baby! And kill! <laughs> kill Ayla! <laughs> what time is it? We probably have enough time for one more ending tonight, at yep. least. There's the three wise men. This is kind of a... It's an interesting ending, because you see all the... Um, there might all be these more sprites, to it. but so far it's not much, is it? Nope, that was it. And the pendant disappears. Chrono Cross definitely has things that call back to Chrono Trigger, but that wasn't what people wanted at the time, and that left a lot of people, myself included at the time, jaded. Because while Chrono Cross does have some aspects of Chrono Trigger, it doesn't have any of the same characters, and aside from one major thing, you need no context from Chrono Trigger, really. That's technically true. I remember playing it. Wow, that was kind of a man one, wasn't it? Actually, let's see. <laughs> Even the guide says that that was probably the worst of them. <laughs> but it was kind of neat seeing those sprites. Hello, Kay. no candy for the kitty. Okay, so. Once Frog joins the party. Mm -hmm. Basically, we can go back. And. I thought you saved earlier than this. You didn't grab the wrong file, did you? I might have. You know what? It doesn't really matter, because all we need to do... No, not if you still have Isla. Oh, shit! Uh, we gotta back it up. Or Sorry. you grabbed the wrong file. And unfortunately, we have to actually, like, exit out of the game. To pull it back up. Eh. And for some reason, it was on a weird screen, so... Sorry! Sorry, chat! <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Yeah, because you saved in the. Okay, go. Also, battle system is also completely different, so it was really a departure from what came before. Construction backing up noise intensifies. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Did you just take another one? Totally. Ah, uh, this was dangerous. Why did we buy this? Because you're like, I want to get more use of my shipping. No, it's because you were getting a kickback on Amazon products last month. That's true, too. <laughs> hey, there's Kitty, everybody. Now we'll move away from Kitty. Ugh. Oh, and don't forget, we need to somehow find a way to die to Magus. Mm -hmm. Because we never did see what happens when he beats you. Mm. We might just have put on really bad gear and just mm -hmm. not fight. Ah, here's other kitty. Got other kitty now. Who's just like, why are you holding me? Whoosh, 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 whoosh. I love how <laughs> Luca 
I summon a great power! I summon a great power! <laughs> Time to see Frog. Finally, we get Frog back! Yay! It's real life. They're like, most, so many of these endings are when you don't even have a full party. Yep. Like, we're finally gonna get Frog to stay with us now. But we're still short, Iowa. And that great power is. Frogs. Quite possibly. Yes. Totally I, I can totally see uh, Luca having the good stuff. Hmm. Knowing where the good stuff is. Have you seen her dad? Hmm. He feels like a guy that, you know, has some connections. Oh, you need that battery? Well, let's see what we can do to hmm. hook you up. Hmm. Oh my god! Luca's dad's like the right. <laughs> mafia boss! <laughs> you scratch my back and I scratch yours. Tech mafia, but he's a robot mafia. Oh yeah, he invents the him and Luca invent the robot mafia. Now future now now we've just connected Chrono Trigger to Futurama. Yep, that's how it happened. <laughs> Hashtag not clickbait. <laughs> It's the something something Moonie. It's the something something Moonie. You would just gonna kick us out otherwise for the night. Right. Frog doesn't have much hospitality, does nope. he? Nope. Flashback. It's the Sailor Moon. <laughs> there you go. So the Masamune is a, like, 15-year-old girl that transforms? <laughs> oh, man. I mean, we won't read much more into that. <laughs> now you have me wondering if anybody's done Chrono Cross X Sailor Moon. I'm sure someone does. And given you Marley don't, you, you and don't, that you don't magical wanna, girl you don't transformations. Want to. You don't want to look into it, though. Are you sure? Yes. Is it one of those things that once seen can never be unseen? Yes. Hey, you don't know her. She's a strong, independent medieval sword who doesn't need a well. <laughs> yes! I just realized his attack is Nirvana Strike. Does he just start singing? <laughs> Cyrus, you smells like teen spirit. It's super effective. Well, on the plus side, my initial uh, my initial look through images did not give me anything either inappropriate nor actually the crossover I was looking for. <laughs> We got a cat misbehaving. Jackson, get down! Cat issues. You know, 
you gotta admit, Frog was probably stronger as Frog than as Cyrus. He had a tongue. Though flies probably didn't taste good when he was human. Nope. <laughs> There's a fanfic. Yeah. First time Frog had to eat a fly. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Okay, who are we taking? Who do you want? Well, we're pretty much going to Lavo, so... Marley? Okay. Because this is Avim after giving the Masamune back, but before confronting Magus. You know, we can't even equip the Masamune still. <laughs> That's because we haven't broken the thing. He hasn't equipped it himself. I think you'll break the thing. We just don't have to go fight Magus. Yeah, if you want to break it, it just says before we fight Magus. So. Yep. Ah. We just got to make sure we don't fight Magus before we go grab the next... Uh, Ending. Oops. Which will probably be our last ending for tonight, considering. Probably. Not too bad, though, four endings. Mm hmm. Like I said, New Game Plus actually flows pretty quickly. Considering you're on ending seven, this is an amazing pace. <laughs> oh, thank you. It helps that we have a guide to give a, to tell us when each ending's coming up. We never would have done all endings though without a guide. We wouldn't have guessed. Honestly, there's something to be said about blind playthroughs, but like with RPGs anymore, I almost feel like you need to play them with a guide because there's so many things you can miss if you don't know what you're looking for. I like, I like having like uh, side quest guides. I don't really need a main game guide necessarily for an RPG, but I like having that guide to tell you, hey, guess what? When you hit this point in the game, you need to go here mm -hmm. to help with the side quest and whatnot so you can get the full story. As usually if main story, you can figure out. But yeah, if you want all the other little stuff and the extra stuff and the other conversations and some of the character building, yada, 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 you really do kind of need a guide or you need a lot of time on your hand. Well, one cat's going crazy. If you don't like side quests, using a guide is fine. Yeah, that's just my... I, I think it's a... I, when I played the Final Fantasy 7 and 8, I played them with a guide just because the guides were actually pretty cool too. Then they made the nine guide where it's like, oh, you want to hear more information about the series? Log on to our website. It's like, you, you ruined it. I don't think it's necessarily a bad thing to do a guided playthrough either. Especially with our, our setup where one person can be on the controller and the other person mm -hmm. can read in the guide. It would actually probably flow pretty well. I always like this little sequence. Although, and the Master Moon is actually to more size. <laughs> scale. Instead of, like, as big as him. This is a pretty cool scene. 
The only annoying part is they play it in game again. <laughs> you know what? I can't help but not see him as a Saiyan now. <laughs> yeah, the lore, the lore has kicked in. It is existing. And one's like an orchestral, and the other's kind of like just a MIDI file. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't think well, I don't think uh, things move like that. Full scene, but I prefer the scene where Chrono gets <laughs> bumped. <laughs> that is a pretty full scene yep. too. Honestly, they did a good job with the cutscenes. They gave you just enough, and the ones they gave you were all actually pretty good. All right. Yep. Except, like I said, I don't think it's still that strong. 57 to like 191 yeah, because we don't have the uh, advanced upgraded version yeah i think we need to stick with the brave sword all right but yep one more battle for tonight against the uh here you want to do it i guess well uh, you don't have to if you don't want to i can I pound can, through it i can pound it And up you this know, you could made an anime series of this easily. Oh, it would have probably been pretty cool. Of course, you would literally have to try and get a Kira Toriyama to animate it. And he'd be like, guys, I'm like 80 years old. I don't know how old he, he is. Doesn't he doesn't animate He's an old much. man now. He's old man at Kira Toriyama. He, I believe he makes the sketches. Yeah. And then they base stuff off of him, and he does. I'm he old man Toriyama does, now. He probably does bits and pieces of story on his creations. Mm -hmm. um, no, it just occurred to me. I probably should have kept the other save file. Which one? Because there's no reason we have to keep starting from right here when you yeah, bring back the save. Okay, Lavos again. Again with the final boss. Ooh. Right? <laughs> like you said, New Game Plus, like, alright, I gotta go fight Lavos. Oh my again. god, have you guys ever seen this boss in your life? I mean, look at this thing! Look! This thing is epic! He, Isn't this the greatest thing you've ever seen? Yeah, it was something from an H.P. Lovecraft novel. <laughs> or story. He never actually made novels. <laughs> porcupine monsters have you he says he has so he has why would raven lie to us we're supposed to trust raven good point send us a picture of your favorite porcupine monster Okay, let's see. What would his best be? Not Frog Squash. No, not Frog Squash. You can do Aerial Strike. Yeah, Aerial Strike maybe. Oh, <laughs> dead. Yes, Hardy. Why would I lie? Is he slain? Actually, we've seen this with Frog, huh? Yeah. No, there's no new dialogue. No, the only one we haven't is beaten Isla. him with is Island Magus. Island Magus. Magus. Okay, let's do this! Once again, Chad, if you have any issues with uh, nipples and laser beams and nipples, 
please look away for just a few minutes because we're about to get flashed. And not the good kind of flash. I think I'm actually liking this form the best. This actually is intimidating. The other form, you're just like, what the fuck is that? And the background is kind of distracting. Actually... This one has the feel of a final boss to It me. does. Even though, once you've it's not, figured yeah. out the fight, it's not much of a final boss. Maybe I should just use Frog Squash. Frog Squash is stronger if you're low on HP. Oh, is that how that one works? Yeah, so, so if he's down to 1 HP, it'll do a lot of damage. But we don't really want that. Yeah. Um, Water 2 will just, like, tap it even. Frog's actually a better when he actually has his weapons fully upgraded. You can maybe start double teching it with Marley once you're ready. About time to MP it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that didn't do much either. You might just be better off with normal attacks from him. Up, oh, you're gonna need to. Uh, I know. Have Marley do it. Uh-oh. Yeah, because the uh, just... you didn't kill uh, the left arm before it could take away oh. his um, status protection. Wait, why did Marley just attack? Yeah. Uh -huh. So I'm slow at fighting this uh -huh. thing. I'm not very fast. Uh -oh. <laughs> Why is the cat? Who does that? You can try Slurp Slash. Jesus. Rise. I didn't say rise. Did I say oh. rise? I didn't mean to if I did. He's consistent at least. Just do a normal attack. <laughs> yeah, it is. Ugh. God, he is nothing without the Masamune fully powered at the end game. Man, he kicks ass once he has full power Masamune. Well, he's balanced, if that's why. He's... A he has okay attack, he has healing, and he has weaker magic. He's a jack-of-all-trades, kind of. 
Like, Marley has great healing, like, weak attack, and, like, actually kind of meh magic. Chrono is the strongest, but he's the main character, so. <laughs> Magus, but honestly, this, yeah. this battle really only just needs Chrono overall. Yeah. Magus has really strong magic, good attack. I just don't believe he has any healing. He has protagonists. <laughs> yep. There you go. He's dead. Well, that was lovely. Nine speed against a rise in Luminaire. Yep. And the most and the most powerful weapon in the game. So yeah, the only thing he doesn't do is heal. He just has you know a rise. Uh oh. Otis hits hard, and Magus has the most potent magic. Yeah, Magus has very, he's probably the strongest magic offensive Yeah, which when we need or. him, we're going to have yeah. to do some training. Because since we didn't use him last time. Yeah. Yeah, technically, now that I think about it, the only ones that don't have any healing are... Chrono technically doesn't have any healing. Magus doesn't have any healing. That might kill Marley. No, she will barely. Doesn't Frog and Marley have a double heal? I could be wrong. Magus and Luke are the only ones that don't have healing, and Chrono. Well, his level might scale, but what about his uh, his uh, his tech? Yeah, that's what we're going to have to probably yeah. grind for is his tech. Oh, no. It's just slow. New farming. Yeah. That's true. Or make sure to take him on, remember that island? That you destroy the floating island with the creatures. Oh no, with you he's hit. He, I didn't get to him in time. Oh well. And he hit Chrono. It's <laughs> not who we want to have that happen to. You might just want to. Actually, you know what? Don't do that. Just make elixir. Because Chrono's at 20 HP anyway, so. We have so many of them. Actually, I have. That was the problem. Mm -hmm. I hadn't got, been able to get haste off yet. You won't be able to bring Magus the Mountain of Well. Oh yeah, because you get him nah, after. That's annoying. You knew what I was talking about. <laughs> <laughs> because that's probably the best place to get a bunch of TP from the people you do have. Just do strike. I'm gonna try. Okay. Might be able to get him on the blackbird, though. Huh. Well, any damage is some damage, at least. That's still 800. It's not super impressive, but I think it's more than what Marley usually pounds out with her most powerful attack, so... Chrono's the offensive cannon of this group. Oops. Okay. I just accidentally attacked the middle guy with Frog.
Now you might want to use water too. Did it uh, put its defense back up? Not that I saw. Give you 100 TP on death. Wow. Just wait till. No, you don't need to arrive. You do need to give him some. Yeah. Just gonna make it elixir? We're gonna get them all back. Might as well, right? That's really the other thing. It's like, how many make elixirs do you have? 13, and we get them all back? Because. Yeah. Well, because you beat the game. Well, technically, on. Oh, fuck you. We're technically on Aw, oh, fuck you? We're technically on New Game Plus 7. Yeah. Or however many we've beaten for endings. I accidentally hit that. There it is. We did it again! Are you excited yet? Right, let's see what this ending is. The Oath! And so Lavos died for a seventh time. Again. Chrono's sleeping. Frog is just hanging out. Luca is fixing up Robo. Phew. This one's a bit stubborn. My apologies, Luca. You don't have to apologize. It was humans who put all these weapons on you in the first place. That idiot's the one who should be apologizing, sitting around sleeping all the time. I should wake him up and make him help. Don't, Don't you, you dare. dare. Oh. Oh. Let him sleep. He's earned it. Fighting that long and hard. Damn right. Hmm. Fine. Whatever. <laughs> Where are you going? I just made some tea. I have some business to attend. who was just woken up. So, did you, like, go back in time to do this, Frog? He's gonna go back in time. Because if you destroy Lavos, the time gates close, so... Oh. So you wish to die in early death? I forgot what voice we used for him. I don't remember. <laughs> Somebody, some oh, film. Gotten into too now. deep. Huh? Someone's gotten themselves in the soup. Uh, Jesus, the text. Picking one man is enough to defeat me.
Ozzy was a guru. Yep. You hear? No. Super Kami Guru's head. The bats. Cock wants that salty man back. Right. <laughs> Kalima, Kalima does move for a Naliri. Yeah, now that does sound something from an H.P. Lovecraft novel. Change of the life of this world. Oh. So you care. You know, really, Magus just trained Frog to be the best he can be. Fiends and humans alike are nigh destroyed. Save you and I, the ones who remain all but sheep. This battle shall have the world as his prize. Have the future. Seems as such, but it is no play prize I seek. It is vengeance. It is the night. I am, I the night. am Batman. Ah, the Masamune. Very well. And they fight. Mm -hmm. Who wins? Um, you'll have to see at the end. Why won't they show us the battle? Yeah, you see, I've seen some people say that it's supposed to be Frog that wins at the end. All you're going to see is a figure with a cape on top of a tower, and since both Frog and Magus wear capes, it is ambiguous. Because, yeah, it's just a person with a cape billowing. Is this Magus's theme? Yeah, nice. it is. Yeah, that could be either of them. Yeah, it could be either of them. The end? Dun, dun, dun. All right, but that will be here. Uh, it for us to know. So that was ending like. number nine? Wait, nine. Did we skip eight? Did we miss an ending? No. You have the guide. Okay, who knows? Number two is in a weird spot, so. Right, yep, that'll be it for us to Naito. So, thank you all for dropping by. Oh, there's an ending log? Hold on, I'll pull it back up. I can pull the game back up. Click through the anime opening. I'm guessing an extras. Aha! No, we got eight. Yep. I guess I just didn't notice. What are these two dash ones? Some of those are like, oh, look, you had Magus in your party. Or look, oh. this changed something. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Are we going on a raid? Um, or are we just calling it tonight? I'm looking. Yeah, my hair. 
Usually we go on a raid. Uh, talk. Okay, so thank you all for dropping by. Dash is various. And joining us for our continued playthrough of Chrono Trigger Additional Endings New Game Plus. You might be going on a raid here. We'll see if any of our favorites are streaming. Not seeing anybody? No, not really. All right. We just may call it here might, then. Might be a... Might be just a rest night for everybody. All right, so... Thank you all, everyone, for dropping by and, you know, spending your Friday with us. Which probably means you don't have better things to do. <laughs> I'm sorry for that. He says that with love. Yeah. Uh, we will be back on Tuesday for the continuation of Chrono Trigger. It was nice to meet you, too. Yes, thank you. Yes, Tuesday is the next Chrono Trigger stream. And who knows, with how good we did today, maybe we'll get to it. I, I imagine that we will get it beat next week by next Friday. There's not that much left to get through yeah, these probably. endings. Yeah, probably. So by next Friday, we'll probably have Two this all wrapped max. up. Two games. Which means we have to prepare our next game. wonder what that'll be. Yeah. You all know, can't see it, but it's the Chrono Trigger title card. And it's hilarious because in it, Frog is looking sideways at Isla's cleavage. <laughs> like, there is no doubt about what he is doing. Hey, maybe Frog was... I'm not going to finish that thought. I mean, like, literally Isla's standing facing him, and his eyes are literally like... Oh, and Isla's oh, probably not even caring because it's Isla. Yep. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. Well, we hope you have a great weekend, and we hope to see you guys again on Tuesday. So, with that, we are Futon Crusaders. I've been Rye. I'm RG. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye, everybody.